in today's video, man, I'm gonna tell you one of the main ways that a woman will embarrass you as a wife or as a mother. Let's talk about it. to the Most High Yah Shalom. Thank you for tuning in to another Righteous Spiritful episode. Today I'm back at it in them trenches handling that kingdom business. Man, just leaving out of an event where everybody was told to wear tasteful, you know, modest, professional apparel, okay? And at this event, we always have this problem, you know, where... It's like people don't have home training. And I, I, I constantly see the headache that married men have to deal with. You know, and I've even experienced having to address this uh, in my own house, you know, as, as, a, as a, a young man, you know, and a man in his 30s now. And you get a lot of pushback, a lot of, uh, you know, rejecting the wisdom that you're trying to impart, but it is an eyesore to see a married woman walk around with her butt cheeks, you know, hanging out. It's hard as a man to try to cleave on to a woman that wants to conduct herself like that. You know, I'm seeing uh, women with kids, no bra, damn their whole titty hanging out, and this is what you call respecting yourself. And you realize these women are at the furthest point of carnality because simply just going to church is not helping. It's not helping if they're not teaching against this stuff. And the women are supposed to clothe themselves uh, in modesty, in modesty. But if you ask uh, a, a rebellious woman what she feels is modest, you're gonna realize, now I see where the problem is. And I tell you, you have to look at yourself as a woman. If you are in like, for men, men for the vast majority are covered. We're not walking around letting letting our, our, our ball sack uh, hang out the bottom of some shorts and be like, ooh, look at his balls, you know, that doesn't work for us, you know? Your average man is going to be uh, modest and covered. It's the complete opposite for the modern woman. You know, it, it, it's the need to try to try to very craftily uh, sell her sexuality, to put it on display. And I, man, I see some of the stuff from these younger, from these younger people that are married, and I'm like, man, this is painful. Your wife is outgoing and damn near butt naked in everybody's face, jumping around crazy, just free spirited. And you can see like, women, I want you to understand, man, when a man sees you like this, no matter what your mouth says, the word says, these people honor me with their lips, but their heart is far from me. And that's the same thing for you, women. You, you're, you say that, your heart is after that man, but your actions show otherwise. See, men are discerning this lip service. And this is why a lot of women don't get chosen because when a man tells you about yourself, you fight him on it, don't wanna make the correction, and now you're having to give men ultimatums and try to manipulate men to marry you. This is why you're not covered. No, nope, you cannot cover in Proverbs chapter seven, in Proverbs chapter seven, verses nine through 10, it talks about a woman dressed in the attire of a harlot. A man cannot cover a woman like that. It goes against righteousness. The most high y'all didn't want you showing every Tom, Dick and Harry what was supposed to be seen in the bedroom, but this is normalized now. You know, you got, and it, it, it's hitting all age groups. 
you got older women that are, are biblically supposed to be teaching the younger women how to conduct themselves. But guess what happens? When you got your grandma shopping at Forever 21 and she's all of 70, you know, here's where the problem is. You know, the average woman doesn't want to go to say, okay, uh, somewhere like Lane Bryant where they got stuff in there that's more covering. You got blazers and the average woman don't want that. They want this sexually uh, provocative stuff. You know, this stuff that keeps them on the edge and on the verge of being a bad bitch. That gets them all the attention when they walk in the room. And I'll be looking at this stuff. I hate having to address soldiers and their wives and tell them that they got to leave because uh, the husbands, I address it and they like, man, I told her not to wear that. I told her not to wear that. And there you see no obedience. You see no submission. You see no respect for the head. And you have to address these women and say, hey, you cannot be out here at this event with your butt cheeks hanging out, your titties hanging out. This ain't that a kind of event. You know what they do? They get pissed off. They get pissed off. But at the end of the day, they still got to leave. I just wanted to, to talk about the headache, you know, and show you the most common way that a, a woman will embarrass her covering. You look at Sierra and Russell Wilson. This woman came out in a doggone mesh outfit, damn near but naked. Look at it. You look at, okay, give it up. Uh, apparently, word on the street is, we don't know how true it is, but Cardi B and uh, whoever her husband is, Offset, you know, is apparently getting a divorce. This is a woman that dressed like a harlot for money and, and still throughout the marriage does the same thing. You look at the Jay-Z's and the Beyonce's constantly dressing like a harlot in the, and this is how a man gets embarrassed. Now these men don't have discernment. These men are not on the right side of the Most High Yah's law so they can't see it. But for the man that's on the right side of the Most High Yah's laws, Yah fearing and commandment keeping, it is an embarrassment. This is why a lot of good men do not want the modern women because your minds are completely gone. You know, you, you take the word modest as to what you feel instead of what the word means. You know, you got to understand if you want to be spiritually, you know, mentally and physically covered by a man, you're going to have to cover up the very same thing that will cause you, if not covered, to defile yourself and lead you to Sheol. Closer to y'all ministries, kicking that thing, gun barrel straight. Wow.